Yo, what's up guys, it's Jack and welcome back. And, you know, in this video I wanted to discuss something that's not necessarily the brightest topic, but it is something that makes me extremely curious until this day, and it's something that I can't fully quite understand, so I figured I'd make a video about it. And at the same time, maybe you guys can help me understand, or at least give me your viewpoint of it as well. And that is, well, what, what is it about Call of Duty that seems to bring the worst out of people? Like, there's a lot of hate and negativity in our community. And from what I've seen, there's, there's more of that than pretty much any other game that I've ever played, except for Call of Duty. And even with me, it, this somehow, like, if you see some of my streams, and they're all on playback on, on the channel, so whichever stream I put up, it's going to be on here. And if you sometimes even see on my streams, there are times where, you know, I, uh, I'm almost getting to the point to where I start to get angry because of the things that happen in game. But it's not it's not necessarily just that, but it's also the fact that, well, there's... Like, whenever a good player does well and beats the other team or whatnot, not only do they get accused of, 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 of cheating or hacking or whatnot, uh, there's just tons and tons of hate mail. Like, when I started to, to get better at this game, uh, I've been receiving, like, out of all the messages I receive, a vast majority of it, by far, is... Some, some of the most disgusting hate mail you could possibly get from playing a video game, really. Uh, you know, and it even gets to the point to where people, like, uh, like even during stream or off stream as well, like, people will, like, you know, they'll threaten to, like, DDoS you or whatever it is that, the, that they want to do if you don't leave the lobby or whatnot. It's, it's pretty it's pretty disgusting. And I, this doesn't happen in any other game, at least to me, and, it, and definitely not as often. And at the same time, it's, it's Call of Duty, and it's like, why? I can't really fully wrap my head around it. I don't get it. When I played Halo, I took, uh, for those of you that, that, that don't know, I, f about, when was it? I'd say about a year ago, if not less or so, less than a year ago. I decided to take a a sabbatical from Call of Duty for at least like for at least uh, this lasted for about six months before I decided to to get back on the on the wagon again. Uh, and I played Halo and I played the competitive playlist in Halo because that was a, the playlist that I enjoyed the most. And I experienced everything from. Uh, kicking ass to getting my ass handed to me. Uh, it was real skill-based matchmaking, and it was extremely competitive. I was learning the callouts, and there were games where I did very well. And also at the same time, there were games where I did didn't do so well. You know, you're gonna you're gonna get that. But uh, but whenever I did do well, and when I was starting to improve, and everything started to click with that game, uh, the opposite happened of what would usually happen in Call of Duty, and that is I would get invites of people that want to play with me. Now, that happens in Call of Duty as well. People people want to play with me in Call of Duty as well. That you know They, they see that I do pretty well, and I get that as well, yes. But um, but in Halo, you know, you get people that will also compliment you more often on your, you know, you're like, hey, you played well, good job, or, you know, let's, let's team up and party up sometime. I got a team, and, you know, let's play this competitive playlist together. And at the same time, even when you when they send you a message, it's not hate at all. As in, I don't think if I was sent hate mail in Halo, it was probably just once or twice at the most out of all the messages that I've received from Halo. In Call of Duty, the opposite. It's like you'll get out of 100 messages, you'll get like maybe three to five that are compliment and complimentary messages or, or things like invites and stuff like that. Whenever a message pops up, it says you received a new message from so and so from Call of Duty. Uh, whenever I play that, I automatically assume it's hate mail before I even before I even uh, look at it, and I still don't get why. I mean, this is the most popular community, uh, but yet I don't quite understand why. I have noticed that in Halo there are a few people that are older that play it, but at the same time. There are a lot of younger people that play it as well, so I, I can't really I can't really blame or point it at the age demographic because I, I don't fully know. But there are a lot of people that play Call of Duty as well, younger and older. So I don't think that really matters as much. But 
it's uh it's something that till this day just really has me curious and I don't really quite understand it so I wanted to make a video and ask you for help or some input or what you guys think it is because I can't figure it out for the life of me I still don't quite understand it and it's and the thing is uh even with me like I said even with me like I don't understand why this is the game that still makes me kind of makes my blood boil a little bit is it because I've dedicated so much time to this game and to get better and that, you know, and that I'm more passionate about it? Is it, I mean, I, I don't get what it is. I mean, personally, I like to, I like, I enjoy every game that I do play and I do like to play well in every game that I do play. But I also understand that I'm human and I'm not invincible. So there are games that I'm not going to play as well as even in Call of Duty. There are times where I play like absolute crap. So, but... I don't know. I guess there's just something about the the game in particular that just I don't know. Is it because you just die much faster and there's more BS that can happen, and when it happens to you, it just absolutely sucks? I don't know. Is it because I've gotten you know skill wise, I'm a little bit better than 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 I used to be, and and I expect more of myself? I don't get it. Or is it just a little bit of everything? So I wanted to make this video to basically ask you guys on your input, like how can you relate, or if maybe you can educate me. <laughs> But yeah, it, it's it's not the brightest subject in the world to talk about, but to me it is an interesting one. So and um and yeah, that's it. So uh by the way guys, if my voice sounds a little bit different uh as of the last few videos, I've been making it I, I've been making it uh to where the first thing I do when I start my day is make a video before I do anything else. So uh, so I'm not sad or depressed or anything, and I'm not sick. And if I was, I'd tell you. But, um, but no, that's uh, that's not the case at all. But uh, let me know down in the comment section what, you, section what you guys think. So anyway, as always, guys, thank you for uh, for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay and the commentary. And if you liked the video, let me know. And if you didn't, let me know what I could do to make my videos better. And I'll let you guys know uh, when streams will continue. I will let you guys know in tomorrow's video. And I'll catch you guys on the next one.